545 and law enforcement agencies here in Las Vegas may be busy writing tickets, but only about half and in some cases even less are paid. So Rachel O'Brien, our friend from OpenTheBooks.com, joins us live to reveal the numbers. It reminds me of the old Seinfeld episode when he's trying to get a rental car and he's like, anyone can take the reservation. It's holding the reservation. So here they are doling out the tickets, but it sounds like a lot of people aren't paying. So Rachel, when we look at Metro first, how many tickets were written last year and then how many were actually paid? So looking at Metro, there were 45,000 traffic violations uh, last year that were filed with the courts. Um, and if all of those were paid, that would have been $8 million in fines. Um, but only about 58% were paid. Um, about 17,000 of those were paid. Uh, 2,000 were paid partially. I'm not sure how that works. There were partial payments made, but uh, in total, less than $5 million out of the $8 million, uh, was paid in, in fines. And that's obviously significant. That is a deficit that is no doubt going to get your attention. So we're a big metropolitan area. Let's now move into Henderson PD area and North Las Vegas. What have those municipalities found? Yeah, they, they sure filed also a lot of traffic citations. North Las Vegas PD, um, they had a total of potential fines actually were more than Metro. Their potential fines were $8.6 million, uh, and they only collected $2.8 million in fines. And that, so that's a 33% collection rate. Henderson PD, um, they had a potential fine a collection of $5 million. Uh, more than five million, they only received about two point seven million. To, so they were also at about a fifty two percent collection rate from those tickets. And Rachel, even at the county level, agencies writing tickets out there, collecting most of the fines. What did you find when you kind of looked in depth there? Yeah, so Clark County, you know, sort of administrative citations, they were only collecting eighteen percent of their fines. So all of Clark County uh agencies that can issue um tickets code enforcement um animal protection services they totaled a potential three million dollars in fines and collectively they only pulled in about five hundred and fifty thousand. code enforcement for things like zoning um building sign enforcement graffiti that sort of thing they issued about 1500 administrative citations and only about 450 were paid um, they also issue parking citations. Um, there are 800 of them, only 400, more than 400 were paid. Animal Protection Services, same thing, 400 administrative citations, only 175 were paid. So they're, um, you know, they're collectively, like I said, 18% in, in, um, collection rate of those fines. So a lot of people are getting away with just not paying these fines. So this is where we say don't be a deadbeat pay your fines and then also since we are headed into this holiday weekend authorities are not messing around here locally if it comes to the rules of the road you better be paying attention no warnings they will issue a ticket it remains to be seen whether that ticket will be paid rachel thank you for your time and your talent this morning enjoy the long holiday weekend and we'll see you next week